been much educated, I have learned. My parents raised me good, taught me what a good education can do for one's quality of life, quantity of bread, frequency of good sex, and the like. Ain't nothing to it. Post-literate, that's where I's at. Can't spell for shit. Can't finish anything, but sure can plan out the whole campaign. No, no how to fix my stereo, but, but don't. don't. That's cause I's affected and effected infused with the hot chocolate morality of the city and the times. What you gonna do when you get out? Go up to Naptown? Get a job as a clerk in a lawyer's office? As a programmer for the insurers of the car you can't afford, but have to buy? How about Silicon Valley? I hear it's real west out there. Or Istanbul, or New Orleans. Where do you go after Bloomington, the eternal city? I've seen so many good heads, good eggs laid to waste by the forced decision. It's over, Chucko. You can't go home, but you can't just go. It's over. Somehow you think that the appeal of the studentine ghetto will wear down and off as you reach predicted maturity. Maybe, mm, maybe not. Cut off the soles of your shoes, climb a tree, and learn to play the flute. Lounge by the shores, naked and carefree. Have late breakfasts at the uptown. Drink more. Smoke more. Plow fields. Peter Pan was right. Don't do it. Don't grow up. Don't leave. You can stay here, deep in the ivory womb. You could get a job as a painter, or start another paper or something. Maybe you can get that recording contract and still live out on Smithville Road. There's, There's this, this great flick where the protagonists muse on the best years of their lives. It was, it was their college days. days. If, if you're, you're even halfway happy, this is as good as it's going to get. Stay here. Don't leave. leave. You could get a job dishwashing at the spoon. Get back to your writing. Buy that old beat-up all-metal electric guitar and learn a few power chords. <laughs> what more do you want for an adequate quality of life? You, you can, can live, live like, like a monarch, monarch here on six lousy bucks, bucks an hour. The secret to surviving is knowing what you don't need, and you, and you need Bloomington. Bloomington. It's, it's in your blood, coagulating your motivation as it massages your soul. You know what will happen? And you will finally get a day off, because you've got to do something. And there will only be two movies worth seeing. Then you'll remember what I'm saying here. I was so conservative and infantile, and how those were the best days of your life.